he was trying his best to, to see what it is that this Christ was talking about. But he says he couldn't do it because he was too short. There was, a, there was something inhibiting him. The, 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 those that were already followers, they were, they were in the way. And, and he couldn't see it because he was too short to see. And there will come times in our lives to when there are issues that we have to deal with, circumstances, our past, issues and flaws in our lives that might make it hard for us to see Christ. Might not have even been raised up in the church. Might, might have been way for a long time. Yeah. Your parents might not have encouraged you along the way to have faith in Christ. There are things that happen in our lives that, that sometimes make it hard for us to see Christ. And this man, Zacchaeus, even a sinner, it said that he was too short when he tried to, to see Jesus for himself. But despite his great wealth, he had a deficiency. Despite who we know, he had a deficiency. Despite how many folk that, despite how many folk he was connected to, he had a deficiency. Despite how popular he was, he had a deficiency. Despite how much money he had, he had a deficiency. And in life, we find ourselves in the same place. We're the most popular. We're, we're the most popular person. Everybody knows us. We're the life of the party. But we have some deficiencies sometimes that cause us not to be able to to see Jesus. But can I tell you, don't allow those deficiencies to, to, to get you frustrated. Because in verse 4, the scripture says that, that, that his deficiency has seemed to be daunting. But it did not deter nor define him. Zacchaeus ran ahead and climbed the sycamore tree. And, and he had his, mind, his mind was made up that he was going to find a way to see Jesus. Had an impediment, had a deficiency. But in his mind, he, he knew that he would find. Jesus. He, he will find a way to see Jesus. And, and in life, uh, not only seeing Jesus, there's some, there's some deficiencies that we have to deal with in life. There may be some, some issues that we deal with when it, when it comes to learning. There might be some issues that it deals with when it comes to being able to, to be social. There, there's some things that, that block our ability to see the things that, that we need to connect to to get forward. But can I tell you, when you have a made up mind, the worst thing you can do is make excuses. When you have a made up mind, you, you'll find a way to get what God has promised you. And it says in verse 4 that Zacchaeus, it says that he ran ahead of them and climbed the sycamore. All these people around and, and he's walking down the road and I can't get to him, I can't touch him, I can't see him, I can't talk to him. I, I want to hear what he's saying and, and I want to be, because I've heard that, that when he speaks, uh, things happen in the lives uh, of those who listen. And, and I'm trying to hear what he's saying, uh, but I can't get a good view. I can't get, get an ish out of him. But he says, but I know he's going down that way. Uh, and so it says he took off ahead of him and climbed up a sycamore tree. He, he didn't make excuses huh, because his parents didn't have a lot of money. Yeah. He didn't make excuses um, because of racism. Uh, he didn't make excuses uh, because of deficiencies in his life. Uh, but he put a plan together. He had a vision. He said, I know I need to hear what he's saying. I, I know I need to see the face of this man. Uh, and in order to do it, I, I can't do it where I am. Uh, but if I make an extra effort, uh, I know he's going that way. Uh, and it says he ran forward uh, and climbed up a sycamore tree. Uh, and there's somebody that's listening to me today. Uh, Oh, don't get in the habit of making excuses uh, why we can't do this uh, and why we can't do that. Uh, the Bible says what it says for a reason. Uh, and it says that we can do all things uh, through Christ who strengthens us. Uh, I don't care how unfair it is. Uh, I don't care how unjust it is. Uh, if we look to the hills from whence cometh our help, uh, if we trust in the Lord uh, with all our heart, mind, and soul, uh, the deficiency it does not matter how large. Uh, the deficiency it does not matter how overwhelming it is appears but if we get a vision and listen to the voice of God God will give us a strategy if we're willing